There is a heritage plaque, but it's right up there. guys it's a bit blowy in car shorten park today but i've come along i just wanted to show you the uh the river flow <laughs> obviously this is a dry bread for for many years i think the last time it was flooded was 2014 but i want to show you the um the river full of water once again we have so much wet weather over sort of february that um our dry bed has uh rewatered it's a lovely sight to see crystal clear as well this all comes down from the river wandle because this is the historic source of the river wandle right by the uh the grotto which we're going to go and have a look at now the grotto was built in the 1700s as part of an estate that never got completed uh, uh, back in the 1760s i think i'm sure someone will correct me on that and it's sort of uh been here ever since what a lovely sight. It's such a shame that they can't open this up and clear it out. I mean, the bottles, they've probably been in there for years. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, it's not, not very nice. I know money's tight. It would be nice to have this refurbished. I know it's only a grotto, but it's history and it's been here for 300 years. There is a heritage plaque, but it's right up there. So I'm not quite sure how you can read it. I think there's some photos online, but my eyesight's pretty good, but even I can't read up there. As you can see, lilies growing, wonderful. It was used to be the busiest river in England for about two, three hundred years when we were doing heavy industry. Lovely. Interesting. Although we're on a lockdown almost, everybody is out. I'm sure keeping a safe distance. Everyone seems to be a little bit happier. I don't understand that. More good mornings than normal. out walking their dogs, riding their bikes, walking. I don't see any isolation at all. Yes, myself included, but I'm keeping away from people. So there you go, guys. This is a very short video from the grotto in Car Shorten Park. I want to quickly show you that. If you like the video, please like, subscribe, leave a comment, hit the little bell notification for more of my nonsense. And we'll see you next time while we're self-isolating.